I'm just warning you now, sis. When you get this dress and you put it on, your line is gonna be blinging. You can do what you wanna live how you wanna spin what you wanna be who you wanna be. We all start up. Hi you guys, it's your girl Janana Cole here and welcome back to my channel. So today I decided to film a current faves. These are the products that I have been obsessed with in the month of February. I know that February is now over. We are now moving into my birthday month. March 30th is my birthday. But yeah, I decided to go ahead and end off February with the cute little February favorites. I have a mixture of many different things. Like I have two dupes to show you guys. I have some hygiene products, hair tools some makeup products so i have like a mixture of everything girls so if you are ready to watch this video and get into it and maybe i could put y'all onto some new things make sure you stay tuned and keep on watching before we get into the video make sure you guys smash that like button and yeah without further ado let's get into my current faves for February. okay so i will be linking everything down below that i show in this video if it has a link some of these items I got from like Ross and Marshall, so they might not have a link, but majority of these things will have a link. I do have some discount codes as well. So make sure you guys are checking out the description box, okay? So you can shop till you drop. So I'm gonna start with hair products and hair tools. So for the month of February, I have been super obsessed with this, okay? So if you've watched my Come Shop With Me video, I actually bought this from, I think I bought it from Ross. So it's this scalp massager, like hair massager type of thing. This was my first month using like a scalp massager and when i tell you this has changed the freaking game for me okay now before this i have never used like anything like this and when i did my last wash when i did my last silk press i used this to kind of like wash my hair i didn't even use like my nails and it also claimed that this can help get rid of dandruff i actually struggle with dandruff and when i tell you i haven't seen like the dandruff have has almost been non-existent ever since i've been using this like i love the bristles i like how comfortable it is in my hand like i feel like everybody needs a scalp massager brush like everybody needs it i remember seeing the hype about these and i used to be like ah eh, you know i could just use my old-fashioned fingers like but once i tried this like i'm never going back like i cannot live life without it and i like this one because it feels really comfortable in my hand also you can use this on dry or wet hair so you could use it in the shower you know when you're washing your hair or you can use it just like as a stimulator to stimulate your scalp so i have been super obsessed with this i have noticed a difference in my scalp since using a scalp massager so if you don't have one please get one like i'm telling you i didn't get the hype but once i got one i was like girl there's no going back so all right so now i want to talk about some makeup products so the first two are actually lip products so this first lip gloss or actually these lip glosses are by she glam and this is from their glitch out line uh, she glam actually sent me their whole glitch out line so i was able to try out these lip glosses and when i tell y'all this video is not sponsored by the way okay but i am obsessed i don't use the heck out of these lip glosses so the first one is this pink one this one is in the color reboot and these lip glosses they first of all they smell amazing like they have like this peppermint kind of smell i love the lip brush mine look a little crazy because like i said she done been through some things okay i've been using her up um this one is pretty much gone like as i don't know if you guys can see but like i have been trying to scrape the bottle i'm actually not wearing it today because i'm trying to savor this for like when i go somewhere like when i go out or something like i'm trying to use this very sparingly until i order another one because i have just been so obsessed the color and pigmentation with these glosses are a freaking one like i this is my favorite like i used to use the nyx butter glosses i believe that's what it's called but ever since I found this one, ever since this came into my life, like, I have not been able to put this gloss down. Like, I am just obsessed. I love the color. It looks good on my chocolate skin. Like, literally, I just pop on a brown lip liner. Pop this on. Girl, your lips look freaking juicy. Like, and I love the pigmentation. I love how creamy it is. Also, this lip gloss lasts for a really long time. Like, you can put it on in the morning time. It's going to last you till at least about lunchtime. Like, it's going to last you a while. So, I love this. I love this color. She Glam did their thing with this. And then the other one that I have is, this one is like a greenish color. Now, I was a little apprehensive, apprehensive to try this one because it is green. Like, I was like, I don't know what this is going to give, girl. But I actually use this one as a topper gloss. So this is in the color .com. I absolutely love that. So this one really does smell like peppermint, but it doesn't feel like tingly on your lips. I kind of wish it did, but it doesn't. 
this smells like peppermint like it literally smells like peppermint the pink one doesn't like it has like a hint of peppermint but this one really does smell like peppermint it's green and it also has like these little sparkles in it i don't know if you guys can see that but this is what it looks like it looks pretty intimidating because who wants to wear a green lip gloss but it's not like super super pigmented like when you put it on your lips you can tell that it has like a green tint to it but i feel like this one is perfect as like a topper gloss so that's exactly what i use it for so i first go in with the brown lip liner I pop my girl, my home girl on, okay, I pop her on, and then I top it off with this green gloss, and I'm telling you, like, you wouldn't think that this, like, this is like Cosmo and Wanda, don't it? Like, it looked like, y'all remember that show, Fairy Out Parents? It looked like Cosmo and Wanda, but y'all know, Cosmo and Wanda went so well together in that show. Like, the same thing with this. You wouldn't ever think to pair a green, a pink and a green lip gloss together, but get this. The only discrepancy, though, with these is I don't like how small it is. Like, I have a love-hate with that. I love it because it can fit in your purse, like, especially if you have a small bag. But I don't like it because it's just like, girl, like, give me the full size. So I wish that they would make these, like, full size um, because this is a little too small for, like, wearing this every single day. That's the only thing I don't really like. But other than that, freaking love these. All right, my last makeup item that I wanted to show you guys. This was a recent purchase. I think if you watch my Come Shop With Me video, I also purchased this mascara in that video i am gonna try to link this one down below i did get it from no i got this one from marshall's but i think i should be able to find the link this is now like when i tell y'all this mascara girl 10 out of freaking 10 i am sold i'm actually pleasantly surprised by this i haven't really heard too much about this i didn't even know milani had mascara if i'm being honest so this one is the milani highly rated anti-gravity mascara now when i tell y'all that title they didn't lie about that when they said highly rated like i get why it was highly rated because this mascara you need it in your life okay i haven't worn false lashes i think the last time i put on false lashes is when i did that chit chat get ready with me video and i think that was like a month ago or two months ago i think it was about, i thought it said it's about a month ago I feel like it was about a month ago since I did that video. Ever since that video, I kid y'all not, I have not placed a false lash on my eyes at all. I don't really have long eyelashes. Like, I don't really think that, you know, my lashes is really going to give y'all what it needs to give. But, like, if you look really closely, you can see how popping my lashes are. Like, I don't have any lash extensions, like, nothing. Like, this mascara is giving what it's supposed to give. Like, I... When I tell you I'm obsessed with it, like I am. So the first thing that I was like, I didn't know if I was gonna like this mascara because of the of the wand. So let me see if I can show y'all. It looks kind of weird. Like I didn't think that it was gonna grab my lashes the way that it does because it just looks so weird. Like I'm not used to having a mascara wand like this shape. But y'all, the way this picks up my lashes, like I don't know, like it just grasps my lashes like, and it just like plumps them up like it almost kind of like curls them up i don't know how to explain it like they meant that like it literally says anti-gravity like, i do love how pigmented it is i love the formulation like it's not too watery but it's also not too thick it's like the perfect consistency everything about this mascara i love and i'm gonna try my best to find the link because honestly like i said i bought this at marshall's and you know when you buy stuff at marshall's there's always like a chance that it might not be there again so Hopefully they sell this in stores or hopefully I can find a link because this mascara has been doing it for me lately, okay? You need this. Your lashes gonna be popping. <laughs> Alright, so now I'm gonna be moving on to the hygiene products, the body, okay? I am super excited to show you guys these next few products. Like, this, this is probably like one of my favorite sections out of everything. Like, I love hygiene. I love body care. But anyways, let's just get into it. So my first favorite for body care goes out to this body scrub now y'all know if you've been watching my hygiene come shop with me videos y'all know i have been on a hunt for a really good body scrub and i'm like so tired of using the same stuff like everybody's always using tree hut we're always using the same scrubs so when i seen this i was like i hope that i like this because i really want to try something different so this one is the clinical works body scrub it's supposed to brighten exfoliate and nourish it is for all skin types i got this in the scent or i don't know i always keep saying scent but it, it has vitamin c in it y'all if you watch my come shop with me video you would you would have seen this as well i picked this up from marshall's and y'all 10 out of freaking 10 like i absolutely love this scrub i still have so much left in here like look how much is left in here like girl i still got a lot left like that was another reason why i really wanted to pick this up 
when I tell you this body scrub, it's kind of like a body scrub slash body wash. Like, I kid you not. Some days I kind of use this as like a light scrub, but like almost like a body wash because when you pick it up and you rub it into your skin, depending on how much pressure you put on your skin, like if you do it really lightly and soft, it kind of like feels like a light exfoliation, but then it turn it like suds up and it turns into a body wash and it leaves your skin feeling so moisturize like oh my gosh if i could find a link to this like y'all have to get y'all have to get this if you see this in marshall's or ross or tj maxx pick this up i'm telling you you're not gonna regret it so i love the fact that when i when i rub it into my skin like it kind of suds up a little bit and it turns into like a nice body wash the smell is just so amazing i'm a huge fan of citrus smells so i love that about this and it honestly like the biggest thing for me and that's what i noticed about the tree hut scrubs is sometimes they can leave your skin feeling you know not as moisturized because tree hut their body scrubs are a bit more harsh you know they are a bit more abrasive but this one i will say is perfect for all skin types like when it said all skin types i was like i don't know about that girl like you know a lot of stuff be saying one size fits all this is good for all hair types and all skin types and then you try and you're like girl why you lying no this is really perfect for all skin types and also too if you're somebody who likes the abrasiveness of the tree hut scrub you can get this with this body scrub it's not as abrasive but you can still get it like i said it just depends on how much pressure you put so the harder you like kind of rub it into your skin and the more like you do like a circular motion the more abrasive this scrub is going to be but if you kind of just like rub it on real lightly on your skin it's not going to be super abrasive and it kind of turns into like this body wash and it suds up and it's just an experience like i love everything about it i love the smell like this i was not expecting to like this body this body scrub i almost want to call it a body wash but i was not expecting to like this as much as i did so like i said if you see this out and about at your local um you know tj maxx marshall's ross make sure you guys pick this up i will try my best to find a link if they have one but if you see this pick this up they do have different scents with this brand i just happen to like the vitamin c one i've never tried the other ones pick it up and also the smell is very potent which i like as well it's like my scrub right now like i love this scrub so this next product i've actually been using this for about two months i would say so this one is the dove even tone deodorant it has vitamin b3 it's supposed to be a tone restoring anti Presprint, I think I'm saying that right, girl, I don't know. This is the Dove Even Tone Deodorant, and when I seen it, I was a little skeptical because I'm like, girl, is this really gonna do something for my arms? But when I seen the reviews, the reviews is what really sold me on this deodorant, so it made me pick it up. I won't lie to y'all, I've been using this deodorant for I think about two months now. I think I started using it in January, if I'm not mistaken. So I am so, like this is actually my second one. So the one that I've been using lately was the Dove Even Tone rejuvenating blossom scent i love this scent it's very light and fresh it does kind of have like that sweet kick to it so this is what this one looks like but i recently picked out uh picked up a new one because this one's running out that's how much i love this deodorant and also too it doesn't leave like those little white stains like you know when you put the deodorant on and it just like it just be looking like it's doing too much <laughs> like no you put it on and this deodorant disappears so i absolutely love that it keeps me dry throughout the day i have noticed a change a difference in my armpits if i have a picture i think i took a picture of when i first started i'll put it on the screen just so you guys can see and then like this is me today like this is probably the lightest my armpits have been in a long time like i don't know like like it literally did what it was supposed to do especially for it to be like a deodorant so i did go ahead and pick up the even tone restoring powder i won't lie if i had to pick between these two scents i definitely would go with the rejuvenating blossom one but this one was on sale at target y'all i think this deodorant retails at target for like 6.99 tell me why i picked this up at target the other day for three i think it was three dollars and fifty cents excuse me what i didn't even know that like it didn't even say i didn't even know that till i went to check out so when i seen that i was like yep i'm gonna get this one so yeah this one really does kind of smell like a it has like a powdery clean smell like it doesn't stink it doesn't smell bad but i'm just like not a huge fan of like powdery smells but it's very light it's very light which is why i went ahead and picked it up anyway and i'm glad that i did it because 
I realized it was on sale. So whatever your natural under pit, your under pit, your underarms, like whatever the color was originally, it's going to help restore it and get it back to that. So you do have to keep using it. You know, you can't use it for a week and be like, girl, I don't see no difference. Like you do have to keep using it. I would say after about the two week mark is when I really started to notice a difference in my armpits. And yeah, even besides the fact that it's supposed to lighten your armpits, I do like it as like a basic deodorant. It does keep me dry. I don't sweat a lot. So yeah, make sure you guys pick this one up. I got both scents. I don't know if they have another scent, um, but when I was at Target, I only seen these two. And yeah, this one's running out. So I just decided to try this one this time. I will link this down below. Make sure you check it out. And you never know, Target might have a sale when you go. So yeah girl pick this one up you definitely need it and plus two summertime springtime is coming around you know we're gonna be wearing crop tops and stuff your armpits are gonna be showing you gonna need that one for the summertime okay sis and my last body care product y'all should already know what this one is about to be everybody has been raving about this product and i'm telling you it's worth the freaking hype need i say anymore like need i say anymore this is the best lotion hands down in the game right now like i said it 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 and listen i'm i'm black okay meaning you gonna see when i get ashy so for me to say this lotion is good as a black person okay because listen our skin be getting real ashy we be looking real crazy that's how you know this lotion is the best my only discrepancy with this lotion is the size i don't like how this lotion be damn near ten dollars okay and it's like yay big like look how big this lotion is like look at that look how thin it is on the side and look how like small this lotion is like i will say this lotion usually can it can almost last me a month i will give it a month almost 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 um, so this scent that I'm using right now, I actually like this one better than coconut water. Well, ooh, I don't know if I could say that. The only other scent that I've tried by this EOS lotion is coconut waters. I really want to try the vanilla one, but every time I try to pick it up, it's gone. Like the girlies be selling that thing out. So I randomly seen this one and I don't really see a lot of people talking about it. This one is the fresh and cozy um, scent. Now this one I feel like pairs really nicely with your perfumes like it's a very fresh like honestly fresh and cozy is the best way to explain it. This is the perfect fresh out of the shower scent but as far as the lotion itself it says it has seven nourishing oils and butters 24 hour moisture soothing protection for dry skin and it also has natural shea butter in it. This yeah definitely like if you was wondering if the EOS lotion was worth the hype, sis, it's worth the hype. My only thing I don't like about this is the size. Like, they need, like, a big, like, a big bottle of this. I think this is this is 16 fluent ounces. But, y'all, everything that it claims to do, it says, say hello to fast absorption, lightweight, soft skin, uh, sustainability shade. It says, say goodbye to greasiness, heaviness, and sticky residue. This is going to be your lotion. Like, this lotion plus this deodorant, y'all need both of these for the summertime. Like, literally, y'all need both of these for the summer. You need this to help lighten up your pits. So when you wear your crop tops and you want to show off your, you know, your skin, you need this one to help even you out. And you need this one because it literally does feel lightweight. Like, you feel super lightweight, but you also feel very moisturized. And a lot of their lotions, the scents, pair super perfectly with perfumes like i haven't worn a perfume that didn't pair nicely with this lotion especially this scent the fresh and cozy scent i love everything about this like honestly i just want to drown myself in this eos lotion like it is definitely worth the hype and i think that y'all should definitely get it this one's bomb i still need to try the vanilla one but i love this one okay you guys so lastly i have two more products to show you guys and these last two products are actually dupes for some high-end things that a lot of the girls be talking about so the first item that i want to show you guys since we just got done talking about hygiene i want to talk about perfume so this perfume i have been obsessed with i am wearing it today like i was not expecting to be this obsessed with this perfume i heard so many great things about this perfume i heard so many ladies talking about it and so when I seen a dupe for it, I was like, I have to pick that up. Now, in case you guys don't know, I do have another channel. That channel is a reaction channel. So I actually am sponsored by Dossier over there. But I swear to you guys, this perfume, I have been wearing this thing out, okay? So this one is the Floral Lavender. And this one is supposed to be inspired by the Marc Jacobs Daisy perfume. Y'all, if you wear this perfume with this EOS lotion, 
baby <laughs> listen you are going to be smelling like a fresh snack like this is another fresh out of the shower scent i have never tried or smelled the original mark daisy um the mark jacobs daisy perfume but y'all oh my god like every time i smell this i just want to drown myself in it this is like such a girly super fresh like this is something that you could put out put on straight out of the shower this is the perfect everyday scent i feel like like just every day you could wear it to the gym i know some people like to wear perfume to the gym i feel like you could wear this to the gym i feel like you could wear this in the office i feel like you could wear this to bed i feel like you could wear this grocery shopping i feel like you could wear this in the house like this is for me this is a signature scent for me personally this could be a signature scent. I'm also a huge fan of the Chanel Chance, um, I think it's Tundrum perfume. This is kind of in the same family as that for me. I think it's the one in the pink or green bottle. I forgot. But this is the bomb. So let me read the notes. So the top notes is watermelon, palomillo, and strawberry. Y'all forgive me. I don't know how to pronounce some of these names. The middle notes is violet, Gardia, gardena and jasmine the base notes is musk vanilla and blonde woods now when i seen the notes i'm not gonna lie i was like kind of iffy because i never smelled watermelon in a perfume or strawberry i wasn't sure about gardenia because i'm not a huge like super flowery scent like i know gardenias can kind of have a strong scent so i wasn't too sure like those three i was like mm, i don't know but when i got it i was like girl like I'm drowning in heaven in this like oh my gosh and I'm telling you this kind of smells like the perfume version of the cozy the fresh and cozy EOS so when I tell y'all when I pair these two together like honestly like it, I just smell so good like I get so many compliments when I wear this I got a compliment wearing this to the grocery store actually the other day so yeah this is the dupe for the Marc Jacobs um daisy perfume um this is actually from dossier i don't even know if i told y'all where it's from this is from dossier i do like i said have a discount code and i do um have a link to it if you want to purchase this but yeah y'all i would get this with my own money like this look how much i've been using i've been trying to use it sparingly because i need to get another one but i went on their website and i bought another one so i'm just waiting for my package to get in so this is how much i've been using it and i literally just got this perfume like anytime i go out i'm like I'm grabbing for it like I noticed I keep grabbing for it I had to tell myself to stop grabbing for this because if I'm going out to dinner I'm grabbing it if I'm going to breakfast I'm grabbing it if I'm going grocery shopping I'm grabbing it like this is my favorite everyday signature scent for me so if you were looking to try the Marc Jacobs Daisy perfume make sure you check out Dossier because they have the perfect dupe for it like literally this is this is what it's supposed to be inspired by so love this i will have this link down below and i will also have a coupon code if you want to purchase it and get money off so yeah my last and final dupe is this freaking dress y'all okay so y'all know skims have those cute little tight you know form-fitting dresses and every time i see them they always look so cute i still want to try the original skims dress but y'all if you kind of want to you know if you if you like me and you've seen them prices you like girl ain't nobody trying that right now i'm not doing all that right now get this dress okay get this dress i'm telling y'all i took pictures in this dress on my instagram i will put a picture up on the screen so you guys can see everybody in a mama like literally if you want your if if you want if you want your boo to hit you up like if you want your ex to hit you up even though listen leave your ex in the past sis but listen i know there's some ladies out there you know or if you just gotta okay maybe leave the ex alone but if you just gotta have a breakup and you trying to pop out you trying to show out you trying to be like listen this is me body is popping the things is thangin get this dress or if you just want to look good for you sis okay you just want to wear this just to look good i'm telling you like people are going to be hitting up your line when i posted those pictures on instagram and i posted a video on my story in this dress my line was a ring, 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 ring. like people was hitting me up the girls was asking me what's the link to the dress what's the link to the dress y'all this dress right here 10 out of 10 i feel like this is the perfect skims dupe i love first of all can we get into the color like the color is amazing i love this khaki color it's very nice especially against my chocolate skin i feel like it looks super good i got this in a size small this is actually from shein i'm a huge shein fan like i love shein the stretch on this i would definitely suggest to size down okay you can get away with sizing down you can get your normal size but if you want it to fit really really good you can get away with sizing down in this dress because it is super stretchy the quality like the quality on this dress is so freaking good like i'm surprised she ain't really outdid herself with this dress they do this dress does come in many different colors i already ordered bunches of, like 
Um, I almost ordered all the colors that they have. I'm waiting for that to also come in the mail as well. But this was the first one that I got. I am obsessed with this. It's super long. I feel like this is going to be perfect for the summertime, especially the spring, the springtime as well. Um, also, it does kind of have this little slit part under here for like your boobs. So you ain't got to worry about nothing being see-through. It's not see-through. This dress is just amazing. Like if you want your, I'm, I'm, I'm just warning you now, sis, when you get this dress and you put it on, your line is going to be blinging, okay? People's going to be hitting your line. They're going to be like, sis, you look freaking good. So I would, suggest, I would say that this is definitely a skims dupe. So if you ain't trying to pay the price for skims, but you still want to look like, you know, you still want the body to be given skims, get this dress. Get this dress. Get this dress. I'm going to link it down below for you. You need it. 10 out of free. That was my current faves for February. These are the products that I have been super obsessed with. When I tell y'all, every time I turn around, I noticed that I was really gravitating towards all of these products. So when I thought and I sat down before I filmed this video, I'm like, what products have I been really gravitating towards? And I didn't even really have to think about it. I was like, oh, this mascara, this body scrub, this, this, this lotion, this dress, this perfume. Like, I just started grabbing it and I was like, all right, this is solid. So like I said, everything that I mentioned will be down below in the description box. If I can find the links, I should be able to find the links for everything. If I have any discount codes, I know I have a discount code for the perfume. I will also put that in the description box as well. Let me know if you guys have ever tried any of these products that I mentioned. Also, let me know if I might have put you on to something new. Let me know if you're willing to try some of these items down below. But yeah, this is the end of today's video. I hope that you all enjoyed. Don't forget to follow me on all of my social medias. It'll be down below in the description box with the direct links. Thank you all so much for watching. And of course, as always, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, Say you guys. gotta work from three to nine. Oh, I get you home by a decent time. Wait, your bed, you can sleep in mine. Yeah, let's make it happen, girl. I need some time.